Hello everyone, welcome to part 7 of the Dark Souls playthrough I'm doing. And today I decided to show you guys how I do a bit of my farming that I use to get a bunch of souls in little time, I guess. So pretty much I am in... I forget what this area is called, but... In the very beginning, when I farmed for souls, I would come by and kill these six guys over here. Okay, there's the fourth one down. And I would come kill him. And that would give me just about 460 souls. But as I progressed through the game, I actually unlocked the shortcut to the dragon. Or wyvern, whatever you guys want to call them. So just run right up here. You know, make him a little angry. He'll shoot his fire. And that's an extra 555 souls. So pretty much if you keep doing this, you'll pretty much get a thousand souls every minute. So whenever I had the 102,000 souls, yeah, that took about three hours. And farming on here is a little bit of pain in the butt. But it gets the job done for whenever I need to buy something. So I guess uh, just sit back, relax, and enjoy the farming. Okay, so now some of you may be wondering why I choose this area to farm in over anywhere else that will give me more souls. I choose this area because most of the time I can kill everything in one hit. And with the dragon up there, it's pretty much extra souls for doing nothing. So that is why I come here every time I want to farm, so that way I can, you know, go ahead and get a lot more done in the least amount of effort possible. Because if I were to go somewhere else like the Dark Forest, it would take me about, I would say eight hits to kill one of those giant armored guys compared to one hit here that I can do in several rounds of for like a thousand souls a minute. 
But luckily, we do not need that many. Because we're not going to buy as many soul or spells. We can only hold up to four, I believe. So the plan will be to buy two that I think will be most useful while we go through and continue the story. And we'll buy more as we go on. Let's take care of him real fast. But, yeah, let's just get to it. But the two that I think will be, uh... Who's interrupting me? You really followed me just to get yourself... Oh. Um. I'm so sorry I hit you. Please don't kill me. Thank you, sir. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and head back to the bonfire and give them a little, a little test. Okay, so we return back here for attempt number two. Hopefully I can do somewhat better than I did last time. That's the hopes, anyways. But there's no time just sitting around waiting. We are just gonna go ahead and, uh, go right in. Oh. Um, never mind. We didn't even get a chance. Okay, so here's to another round of fighting the dog guy again. I really don't know if I should just go in with my sword or what's the best approach to him. But we're just going to go in and have our shield up. Or roll. can't do anything with these little guys. Okay, so, uh... Um... He can't summon more of them, can he? His name is Coppera. Like, Copper? I have no clue how I survived this. Even my character's confused on where to look. I'm safe here. Wow. Actually beat him. And I got back six thousand souls. Nice, nice. There's actually nothing else here, I believe. It sucks my sword couldn't do much more. I assume the only way to go now is uh down? But... I gotta be careful. Wow, that actually one hit him? Oh no. See, I knew something was there. I wonder how I could get my max spell usage up. Let's 
so a big empty room. What's going to jump out? Um, okay, there's a door here. Uh, I don't think I should go there yet. And I can't close it, so up we go. Oh, he's up here. Did that kill him? Nope. And I missed. Isn't it fun just unlocking new places? And... I mean, I guess I can run through here. But if something kills me, that's gonna suck. Wait a minute. Are you serious? We're back at Firelink Shrine? Well, close to Firelink. That's interesting. It's like everything connects to it. I don't need to heal really right now. I think we can just continue on. Wait. Is that a person? How did I not see him the first time? I mean, what you got for sale? Oh, he was serious about having moss. I mean... Path marker? Drop and listen to check heights. That? That's kind of interesting. And I can buy humanity off him. Uh... So, I don't really have... Much that I want to buy off him right now. Uh, let's see here. I think the best thing we can buy off him right now is... Just the bones. Because we kind of need more of these. And then we're also gonna... Yeah, that's all. Uh, actually, we're gonna go ahead and... No, we'll just leave him there. I'm sure if we come back, he'll be there. But at least we have a shortcut now. So, I assume we're going to the depths? Okay. Ah, my first enemy here. Ah. Oh, they thought they could jump me. I actually do have a few items that I need to equipped if they're better that I got from a bandit. At least I think they're bandits. I don't know what to call them. Huh. Can I reach them? Hey, 
Hey, I think your friend just dropped. At least I can clear the area a little bit before I go down there. Now then, more crates to break. Unfortunately, there's nothing in them. I hear someone trying to... There he is. Why are you guys just now coming? Is that a... Is he a friend or a foe? Aww. I really thought he'd be a friend. He's coming fast. Where'd he go? Oh, come on, buddy. Why can't we be friends? You like to chop stuff up. I like to chop enemies' heads off. Are you sure we can't be friends? I tried. And all he gave me was a sack. Um, okay then. Okay, so after going through my inventory a little bit, I actually don't have anything better than what I have right now. So, oh. Aw oh, man, these dogs again. Heal, heal, heal. I need to take care of them before they cause a blood loss. Or, what's it called? Okay. If they want to fight me, they're coming up here. Because I am not using my sword on them anymore. They're getting annoying up close. Okay. That's it. I'm sorry to my viewers, but I am killing every dog on site now. Not only are they annoying, but they do a lot of damage. And now I have no health potions. Or flask in this case. I don't trust that drop. Nor this chest, but I'm going to open it anyways. I wonder if the blacksmith can take my embers. Oh look, another dog. Goodbye. Man. I'm heartless. And I... ah, I don't trust what's in this water either. So... There is another way down there. I could just come over here. Wait a minute, that's not the, uh... Is there stairs going down there? Wait. 
Wow, look at him trying to hide up there. And I, if I can hit him. Let's see, uh, right about. I want to say right about here. Yeah. And, oh, you got saved. You seriously got saved. Uh, I guess I'll use my great soul arrows. And now I have to go to him. Or he's running back up. Okay, so now I know how to get over there. Ooh, on second thought, I think he needs a bomb. Come on. Well, nothing wants to come to me, so... Uh-oh. So... I'm in a bit of trouble. If I die, it's gonna be really hard to get back. Don't... He went back in the water? So it seems like I'm actually not as prepared as I thought. I mean, if I would have rested at the bonfire, I probably would have a chance. Okay. And boom. I was getting tired of him. So let's go ahead and take him out. Then him. He can just take a bomb. Uh, so I think... If I come over here... Oh hey, there's a door. That goes even deeper. But you're out already. So, are you going to, like, reward me or something? Oh, hello, Ned. 
Okay, so assuming by his hand, he's a pyromancer. The only reason I know this is because, well, pyromancers are the only ones whose hands glow red. And since we're pretty close to death, actually, I feel like I'm just going to go ahead and take a risk over here with this hole that I found. If I die, then oh well. Oh. Um. Mistakes were made. Look at that thing. That is a huge rat. I don't even know how to get out of here. So I can either run away with my souls. Or, um... Something's about to come out. Oh, it's just the water... What does someone do in this situation? I have no way to get back up, and... Oh, I can run over here. Please tell me that is not on my side. Uh, firebomb away. So, uh, if I jump, there's a chance of death. Trapped humanity, sewer chamber key. So we're just going to go ahead and run through this. I don't know exactly what's going on here, but I don't want to stay to find out. Okay, so we're running away. Okay, so we barely made that out alive. So, I think I'll just call it a day here. Until next time, guys. Bye!